we should start it off. Every episode should start just like that. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. Every episode is not just like that. Yes. Oh, here we go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are to, you ready? I wish I could um, say. I wish I could um, change. Oh, you need, I can turn the light on. No, no, no. You sure? Is it a button? Yeah, I got you. Boom. Oh, you sound like a demon. <laughs> oh, my goodness, do I? Oh, I like it. I want to hear this. It sounds bad. Oh, no, it sounds, this probably sounds amazing. Hello. What's in here? Give me, give me the headphones. Pod. <laughs> oh, oh this, this sounds so weird. weird. <laughs> <laughs> The real world pop. My name is David, and I'm here with my co-host, the the word about her uh, uh, dragon cosplay. Con cosplay that's supposedly going missing by someone. We're not going to say his name, but his name on the show is Oculus Rift. Maybe throw it away because he suggested it was in a trance bag. <laughs> <laughs> Well, but, no, he might have mistaken it. it boy, it was he trash bag. might have mistaken it as trash, even though he's the one that they put in the trash bag, because it'd be easy to carry through the con. But I'm just saying, maybe you should recognize when it's not trash, but you don't want to clean up your room for some possible reason. You ain't cleaned up any other day, but right now you want to clean up? Oh, no, we were. We've been cleaning up for, like, days. Hmm. Yeah. That's, mm -hmm. it literally, that's, I'm like, oh, man. Like, you know, when you're in that you clean, clean, clean. Anyway, clean. uh, uh Eve. That's my co-host's name. That's who you are. Eve. Say something. Say something. Great. Here on The Real World, we take a concept or character from a movie and ask the question, what if it or they were in the real world? We take five minutes to come with three points each, and then we discuss. Eve, tell us what the question is. Before you do that, mm -hmm. side note. So, you know how your parents are always promoting what you do? Well, you don't. But you know, <laughs> <laughs> in general, parents are always trying to promote what you do. Can't like like that person when you're working Loving at a store parents. and those old people come to you and say, well, you know, I used to work here years ago. You don't, you hate it. I don't care. I hate when people do that. But so the, the, my parents would be like, oh, you know, he does a podcast. And I'm like, no, don't do that. Don't do Aww. that. Yeah, I hate it. So my aunt once heard it. Well, she's like, oh, let me see. I'm like, ugh. So I'll pull up my phone. Wow, you sound professional. That's what she said. Aww. So I was like, oh, my gosh. That's but, um, so sweet. No, it's horrible. Um, you don't like when your family listens to your stuff because it's like, I don't know. I wouldn't know. My family has no involvement in any part of my life. So tell us what the question <laughs> is today. <laughs> Before we all cry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the question is, what if everyone was a secret agent? It's Kingsman. That's it. I don't know the rest of the name. I think it's the Golden Circle. Is it the Golden, the golden Circle? Secret Circle or something like that? This is very fabulous. I'm going to go with the Golden Secret Circle. Anyway, so did you see the first Kingsman? Yes. And did you like it? Yes, it's the Golden Circle. Yes, Kingsman, the Golden Circle. On the 22nd, which is my birthday, shorty. You know what? Pre happy birthday. Let's say that right now. Pre, Pre happy, happy birthday. birthday. Pre happy birthday to you. Mm. No, to you. Pre happy birthday to Eve. Mm. Mm -hmm, you, yes. Um, you don't know the rest of the words. Anyway, I mean, um, the so <laughs> yeah, I specifically love the movie because I'm sorry, of, Halle Berry is in this. Yeah, she's on the statesman side. She's she's the she's the and Shannon Tatum. He's on the statesman side. Why do you say Shanning? Shanning. <laughs> Shanning, I'm sorry. You say that every time. <laughs> you always say Shannon Chatham. It's like Shiloh. For some, but that doesn't even make sense because his name is Shiloh. Shiloh. <laughs> Shiloh. I just say. Interesting. Wow. Okay, continue. I'm sorry. Okay, thank you. Uh, anyway, I really like the first one because specifically Sophia Botella's in that woman is gorgeous. That you said Sophia what? Botella. She was the one with the knife legs. Mm. Uh, that woman's gorgeous. But anyway, um... So, I, I assume you're looking forward to the second one, uh, as yes. everyone else should be, because this movie's going to be awesome, hopefully. I see that girl that looks just like the Ed, uh, Taryn Edgerton? Ever, Ed, Taryn Edgerton? Edgerton? Mm, I'm not saying any of those names. The guy, the main guy. I think his name is Taryn Edgerton. Oh, you little homie? Yeah, the yeah, The guy yeah. that was just in Sing, who sounds very nice. Edgerton? I, I think it's Edgerton. Egg no, it's Edgerton. Is I'm getting the same with the E, the girl in ton. Got it's Edgerton. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've heard his name, so I'm pretty. I'm going with that for sure. Um, 
What was that song he sang in Sing? Um, he was he was one of the voices. He was the monkey gorilla. I'm sorry. Stop he, he it. He's a gorilla because he, he really. Yeah, he sang. He was in the. Uh, yeah, we're the same age. He was in that. He was in the alleyway, and he was singing. Hmm. Now I know who you're talking about. I just didn't know that was his voice. I didn't know he little homie could sing. Go ahead, little oh, shot. If I feel that I should be certain, then that song. He's like, should I say the things? Mm. His little accent. I love him even I more now. To say me. Uh, shout out to the spy who loves him. He was in Legend. Oh, duh! He was in Legend. Wow. Anyway, um, <laughs> the spy, the, the my friend who you call a spy. Yes. She loves uh, Taryn Edgerton. I was just over her place yesterday. Um, uh-huh. She adores him. Mm. But uh, anyway, uh, yeah, onto the episode because we're all we're both looking forward to the movie. So onto the episode. So the question was, what if everyone was a secret agent? That's what we said, secret agent. Um, yes. What if everyone was a secret agent? Great. Three <laughs> points in five minutes. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> And we're back. And the question was, what if everyone was a secret agent? My Ladies first one first. is don't. Just don't. Do, don't? Don't. Okay. What is that slang? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's a different accent, oh. really. But don't. Who's? From which country? <laughs> that is irrelevant. Okay. <laughs> it was dope. Okay, great. Tell us what it is. My first point is that school tests, okay, would all be timed and oh the reason for them being tied because they're going to self-destruct so you have a limited time to complete on my the test. paper on my test my paper yes. test mm-hmm. not like a diffuse a bomb test like literally scantron filling mm-hmm. bubbles it's going to explode this, yes this is flammable because all of all of this we're going to be able to get it to our database you know what it's dumb Mm-hmm. But I really, really like it. You got to teach the kids. Mm-hmm. Now, is it okay? Is it destructing because I have to finish in time, or do I think the question's right? See, that's what I was thinking. Should your answers determine if it self destructs or doesn't? <gasps> I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Everybody with a B and below is self destructs. No, no, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Got it. It's time, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. You, it, it's like, um, you know, the racing games where you go through a checkpoint and you get a little bit of more time. Mm-hmm. It's like that. So you answer a question, mm-hmm. you get a little more time. You answer right. You get like, um, like, like, like a minute for the seconds. next, yeah, 15 for the next problem. I got to yes. read it. What if it's wire problems? 15 seconds. Okay. 30, please. Okay. Please. Okay. 30. 20 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. So you get 20 seconds per question. Mm-hmm. Get it right. I get 20. Get it wrong. It's minus five off Ooh. of the 20 that I just got. So it's like, so I'm erasing. <laughs> and trying, to get, <laughs> trying to get the right answer. Oh. There you go. So then when you go home and you know, like, it's like, uh, so how'd you do on your test? You're like, literally you can say, I didn't have enough time. I didn't finish. <laughs> like or, or, or I don't have to ask when you come in the door, I see the sill on your face. You mm-hmm. didn't do well. Did you? <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> that is so cool and funny. Yes, I yes. would please. Ah, oh, I want to show with this with little kids and their yes, faces exploding. Yes, but I it's thought so it so funny. I thought it would be. I thought it would be. Uh, I, I kind of uh, want to write this. Okay, I'm going. Uh, if we want to uh, tag team on this, that'd be so funny. A secret agent that. school. Yeah, secret agent school for little mm-hmm. kids. That'd be fun. What's the age? Are we just doing with like middle school down? Not down. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, like, from, like what, like first grade up no, to no, middle no. school, uh, or are you no, doing no, no, all no. of high school, middle school and high school, middle school and high school. Yeah, yeah, I feel yeah, like yeah. that's a lot. I feel like it should be like eighth grade then high school in terms of writing. Is it middle school eighth grade? Yeah, that's why I said only eighth so, grade. So that way, it's like the, you have the, the trans- middle school. You have. I mean, what other grades count in middle school? Six, seventh, eighth. Oh. Yeah, instead of doing all of the grades in all of high school. I like all the grades. I just need younger young people in there. So that's why I said middle school. Because I'm going to have, no, but I want like a, like a sixth a young, grader young. to be like a jerk, but he's really this good at everything. This is a small school. This is a charter school. Yeah, it's one of those. Mm-hmm. So it can go all the way up to that grade. Okay. Mm-hmm. Preparatory school. Sixth grade only um, has what, like seven people? In a class? Sixth grade, just sixth grade. I feel like you can get more as you, the classes grow. I think it'll just be a regular size. It'll be the size of like a Fillmore type school on Disney. That's that, a lot of people. It was a lot of people. Exactly. But a lot didn't say much. Ex- <laughs> I mean, I don't need to know all the characters. I'm just, they're just walking around. Who cares? <laughs> we have our main core that we'll care about. Mm-hmm. That'll probably be the little kid will only be somebody's brother who's in the older group. That's why he's, we know him. That's it it. Are these groups or is there like a family? No, it's a, it's a group of friends that mm-hmm. are the agents that we care about. 
that we see in the of show. Of course, there's one from sixth grade. It has to be the youngest. No, no, no. The sixth grader is one of their siblings, like their brother, their okay. little brother. That's the only reason he's around. Okay. And maybe we but know everybody his, else is his, high school. Everyone else is high school that we know of that are friends. Mm-hmm. And then he maybe has a fr- little six year old has a friend who's like there with him all the time. So we're like, get your friend and go away. And maybe the friend mm-hmm. doesn't even have a name or whatever, like Pacho or something, like some some random name they they named. And then him. we have like the bad assassin, but she's like super ditzy. Oh. I yeah. like it though. Mm-hmm. I like it. Yeah. I like it. Switch it up. No bad. Because usually they're usually like I'm hard, I'm core. But right. She, she's like this, like ah, but she can kill. She, With yeah, she no hesitation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Okay, yeah. cool, cool, cool. Okay. Oh, we created a whole show. <laughs> 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 Sorry for that tangent, guys. Uh, <laughs> that's funny though. Um, this is where the podcast developed. Yeah, if you ever uh, wanted to know. Just a tangent. Um, Your point. My point is that. Sex would be banned, okay? Why? Here's why. 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 Any good reason? I mean, pointless sex. Like you. Like like not. What is pointless sex? I mean, compared to we're together, we have sex. If you're not in a relationship, you can't have sex. Lame. Here's why. You're a secret agent. Exactly. Exactly. This is why I thought of it. James Bond. Okay, the recent James Bond that have come out. Every time he has sex with a woman, she dies. Okay. They t- <laughs> She, this woman gets killed somehow. So I'm like, maybe he should stop having sex with people. He's a death wish. So um, it's kind of like my curse. Wherever I date someone and we break up, with, they get pregnant uh-huh. um, when they're with their next person automatically. It just mm-hmm. happens. Like, literally, I should have a service. But um, so he, every time he has sex with someone, they just die and they get killed. So no more fruitless sex with people because they'll die unless you really are committed to a relationship. Unless, here's the thing. I am a secret agent trying to kill you. Okay. Mm-hmm. I have sex with you because I want you to die. <laughs> Somehow you get killed because the earth just makes it happen. There you go. That's my point. All right. I yeah. don't like it. James Bond. Go, go back and watch some James Bond. But I think Bond. he cared about those women. That's no, why. No, he did not. Look, go look at Daniel Craig. He don't care about the women. You can see it in his eyes. He has a stone cold face. He has no love in his face. He's so hard. <laughs> hey, literally, this is why we need to have sex. No, <laughs> they feel no passion. He's just hard all the time. Cause see, I feel just like angry. the lack of sex is no, actually. No, he's not even angry. He has a stale face. This may hinder the secret agents. It this won't. Is why... It won't because you'll still have families and other things to grow, and they'll have sex. But it only happens when but you're grown up. Oh, here's, 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 here's the thing. 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 Only when you're grown up. Okay, only young kids. I'm saying, as in young kids running oh. around. They, we can't control them. The, the, the effect doesn't happen to them. Okay, spread your teenagers, <laughs> teenagers are spreading their loins. Their fruit of the looms are all around the world. Oh, my okay, goodness. Oh, you can't my stop goodness. it. But when you're grown up, when you hit what's what's when considered you're a grown, grown up? How old is a grown? up? Yeah, how, what's considered a grown up? Like twenty one. Twenty one is considered. Okay. I mean legally. Legally, okay, twenty one. You hit twenty one. They're like, hey man. You, you gotta get serious, or you're gonna end up killing all these women you care about. No, I want. I still have sex. Wow, she did. Like a, a spear comes through and shit. Okay, well, like, you said men killing the women that they sleep with. Women so too. Women, women mm-hmm. too. Women too. Hmm. Well, oh, they both get killed. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Whoever initiated the sex is the one that doesn't get killed. So if a woman tries to come up to a man and she has sex with him, the man gets what killed. What is the man come, sex? I come up and grab your boobs. <laughs> <laughs> it's initiating the sex. It's a, it that's is. never happened to it's you. A, it's not a random it's Tuesday. Happened. It's happened. Yep, yep, yep. All right, you know. I go on and bump your little, little coochie area. Yep. I'm sorry. It's, no, you bump your little, <laughs> your little no-no knocking. spots. <laughs> Your no no spots. Your no no spots. You'll be like, oh my. No. Oh, goodness. That's initiating. I love so, that. yeah, that's what will happen. That, the other person gets killed. Yep. The no no spots. Don't you touch my no no's. Yeah. Oh, that'd be so cute. But, um, yeah, moving on. What's your next point? So, for my next point, is there would be more. How I want to phrase this. I want to say more deaths. Yeah, because everyone's killing people. But the reason. Accidental deaths. We'll go with that. Yeah, more accidental deaths because this is this is how it goes down. Or maybe more people taking prescription drugs because you have to think about it, if everyone is a secret agent, uh-huh. you have to become a target at some point. You don't know when this is going to happen. Not necessarily. I don't have to. They're gonna want you dead for some. What reason. if I'm a desk person? <laughs> I couldn't hack it in the field, but I'm still. Oh well, I still need to kill you because you're the one oh, guiding them the way. They're telling them where they need to go, no, helping really, with security. I'm, I'm I'm in human resources. I take care. I take care of lunches. 
<laughs> That's what human resources does. No, like, I'm just telling you another job that I could have. Like, I gotta take care of lunches. No, uh, you can smuggle things into your in agent. Lunch? Mm-hmm. Yes. What am I smuggling in? You could bologna, put a, <laughs> uh, a razor blade in the bologna sandwich. But I'm feeding my already... own agents. Exactly. Why would I? Get... <laughs> You're passing messages along, written into to the bologna, <laughs> mm-hmm. on top of the cheese and the mayo will just be like two dots. It's going to be like you really um, a braille. really sandwich, aren't you? <laughs> Not braille. Yeah, no. no, I mean the, the little dots. You're going to put little dots of mayo as one message. So can I feel it? <laughs> <laughs> I think it'll smush. <laughs> That's a part of the secret message. So with this, um, all this going on, you're paranoid. You know, you're anxious. You know, you just, you're, you honestly, ah, boom, change the point. Start over. Seriously? Yeah, but it still goes, it can still go with this. Is that now the point is more people are going mentally insane because every day of your life you have to wake up and go to sleep with the potential thought that you may die and you don't know who's after you or who's trying to kill you and I'm not trying to live with all that stress. So I I'm gonna go agree crazy. with that, but also I think that some people get into that I don't care mood. Mm-hmm. Like you know what, when it ends, it ends for me, and you're just like I'm, I'm, uh, you know, whatever. And they'll take more risk in life, whatever. Walk in the street, cl- close your eyes, whatever. Who cares? Just, yeah, that's a risk. When I, I was die, thinking maybe I hey, empty out my bank account and just move to Europe, but whatever. Why not empty it out? I can just move that money into an overseas account. Mm, I like the dramatic effect. I see that. <laughs> I emptied out my bank account. <laughs> Deuces, homie. Yes. You know, you didn't have to, man. We have we like, have contacts overseas. We could have just transported it over there. It's fine. Yeah, we could you have know. transferred all your money. I didn't want to pay those fees. It's literally free. We we they're actually our main bank. We are a subsidiary under them. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like you come to the new bank. You're like they're like, okay, would you like to start an account? Yes, I would. And then they put your name. Well, we had you, and you ended your. I did. Y'all the same people. <laughs> Oh, man, I, 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 I thought y'all were different. Like, ma'am, it still says Bank of America. Ah, uh, well, <laughs> interesting. Liberty Mutual is the same thing. Like, anyway, um, yes, cool, 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 yes. cool, 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 cool. Okay, I like it. I yes, like it. more fine. people going crazy. What you got, Dave? Ugh. Id. There we go. David. Everyone would have two families or more. Okay. Who paying for all these families? What are you talking about? I'm getting paid for killing people. You get paid a lot of money for killing somebody. True. You're a secret agent. Okay. You're, you're stealing from the government or whatever branch you are. But anyway, the point is, okay, so you have to, you are, you have a family. You and Oculus Rift have a family. A loving son named Corbin. A little okay. chocolate boy. <laughs> no, he's of a different flavor and Oculus Rift is confused as if as if his child. But anyway, we don't go down that road. But he looks very similar to your next door neighbor, um, who is also a Spanish man. Um, <laughs> Go ahead. You anyway, anyway, so you have a family. You and Oculus Rift have little Corbin, and um, you have to go on a mission, right? So you go, and your mission involves um, trying to kill a um, some investment banker somewhere because it's something, 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 something. Anyway, but he lives in a neighborhood, and you have to infiltrate that neighborhood. But you can't just be a single person in that neighborhood because it's a family type neighborhood. So you, what you do is you have another family there that, you know, you established for years. So now you have another husband. We'll call him um, HTC Vive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> or PlayStation. Uh, what's it? What's it? What is he? He's Oculus Rift. What's PlayStation's uh, version of that? Of Oculus Rift? Mm-hmm. Is um PlayStation VR? PlayStation. So you have another husband. His name's PlayStation VR, uh, PVR for short. Okay. So, no doubt. <laughs> little Sony. His name is Sony. So yeah, we'll call him Sony. So you, Sony, and your other child. Do you have another uh, son name that you would? Uh, How many kids have I got so far? You only got one, Corbin. Oh. I know you have two sons. I know you got two names. No, nah, I just got one. You only got Corbin. Yeah. Okay, he's gonna be the Corban, and uh, so you don't miss the things. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> oh gosh, that's funny. Um, you name him. Uh, what's his name? Um, um. Why do I have to have another kid? We just got one. Nah, you got one with him too. It's a family uh, neighborhood. But anyway, you have this other family. Okay, I don't have a family unless I have two kids. No, one kid. Oh, okay. one kid's in another neighborhood. The other kid's in another town oh. or neighborhood. Oh, because I'm the spy. Yeah, you're okay. the spy. Okay, so okay, you okay. got two families to establish. Oh, your... then they're both named Corbin. We are gonna keep it easy. <laughs> what you mean? <laughs> 
<laughs> that way I don't even have to think about <laughs> which name It'll is like Corbin who my name is Jack mm, god dang it I should name <laughs> exactly no. and the then my name. husband his name is still gonna be Oculus what? Rift <laughs> cause we're gonna go find the same man with same different same different man same name <laughs> Okay, we ain't got to try to think about none of this, all right? That is so funny and sad. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You start comparing them. Oh, my gosh. But, yeah, I think that's why people have dual families because they're trying to, they're, they're trying to infiltrate and do a job over here and also like, keep this front up over here. Mm-hmm. And that's my reasoning. Okay. Yep. I think it makes good sense. All right. All yeah, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's not... It's not horrible. Thank, thank you, thank you, thank oh, you. Because that's you know what, what that's what every child wants to hear. That's what every child wants to hear. You Mommy, how do I look? It's, you're not horrible. Okay, you're not, ugly. you're not ugly. Like I said last yeah. time, when you said that. Yeah, I haven't actually let Oculus rip. We were in the car waiting to eat, uh-huh. and I played that, and he was like, "Wait, what did he say?" What the the Instagram? Yeah, yeah. the Instagram post about it, and he was like, "Yeah," he was like, "Yeah, that's pretty. That's pretty accurate. That's how you describe stuff." <laughs> And then it was funny, like, I think by the time we got home, he asked me something. And I was like, I'm not, you know, he asked me, how do you feel? And I was like, what do you mean? I'm like, I'm not sad. Is that? He's like, he's like, yep, that's the guy. That's pretty much the answer I'm going to get. So I was like, whatever. <laughs> that's hilarious. Uh, people, if you don't know what we're talking about, go on Instagram. You'll see a post that yes. explains how Eve references things <laughs> and how she describes things. It's very funny. So, what's your next point? Because I got it. All right. So, my last point. Last point, go. Is that... Perfect. (laughs) (laughs) I really connect with it. It's not overall. Overalls, Um, yes. I also have... (laughs) <laughs> what? pants and, <laughs> and jeans you have overalls or else yes i actually don't have overalls i don't either i feel like it looks like the most uncomfortable thing ever i don't think it's uncomfortable i know it's but all it jeans convenient. but it looks like it itches if you and don't sweaty. wear underwear i think it's sweaty and overalls yes i think it's sweaty i think i'm thinking short overalls i'm thinking full overalls like pants and everything going over your yeah everything's like you know i think that'd be pretty comfortable out there I like it's and, hot no they're pretty i don't think a lot of air gets in there what why is y'all so tight? Like, not, is that supposed not, to be I just tight? Feel like I feel like not it's a lot of it's jeans. It's not like a wind jacket or something. Okay. Anyway, what's your, my what's your point, point? Yes, yeah. um, there would be what is what is it called? Is it all body scanners? Full body scanners. Full body scanners. Thank you. All Full, bodies. Well, all the bodies. <laughs> Everybody. No discrimination. Everybody, yeah, no discrimination. All the bodies. Full body scanners would be implemented into every building. Yep. Because when you said that, my first thought went to uh, McDonald's for some reason. Because somebody <laughs> apparently wants to shoot up McDonald's. Yeah, like, there's... hey, scan your body. You might come in here and try to steal one of these hamburgers. Mm-hmm. And this is a part two. So you have whole whole body, all, all, whole, whole body scanners. <laughs> right. Full body scanners. Full body scanners. All body scanners. <laughs> <laughs> all full whole body scanners. But. But, yes. You are allowed. Laws will be changed to where you are only allowed to bring X amount of or type of weapons into said building since everyone now is a secret agent. So it's like, eh, okay, I guess you can have a 49 on you or a 42 pistol. You can have that. But you're just making up numbers. I could just pick cherry picking. Okay. Let's go with 39 Glock. That is a real thing. You can have a 39 Glock on you. That's fine. But you cannot come here with a bazooka. Yeah. You know, I'm wanting to carry that around. I think that maybe it's more like, yes, you can bring your gun in here for protection, but you can only bring in one bullet. So it's not like a full on shootout and massacre. Okay. Aww. Everybody gets one bullet. I guess that's nice. Just if somebody tries you, sure. You, you can, only got you can, one shot. You only got one shot. Okay. <laughs> they got one shot. You got one shot. Everything's good. Okay. We ain't got all this stuff going on back and forth trying to kill people. Okay. We ain't got time for that. Okay. One bullet. Okay. Oh, okay. You don't I want guess. it to make it like the church scene in the first Kingsman. Nah, 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 and it's McDonald's. Not, why are we at McDonald's? Oh. I don't know. If that's a, that's like, a word. Because nobody's going to the Chick-fil-A trying to shoot up anybody. Everyone's too happy about the chicken. This is true. Everybody's like, all right, fine. We'll take our weapons out. Exactly. We'll leave them in the car. Okay, cool. Woo-woo. Okay, so my last point is that everyone would be banned from walking on the street. Okay, got it. Everyone would be banned, banned from walking? Banned from walking on the street. So can we run? No, no running at all. 
No people? You can, I guess you could run. I mean, what are, how Not are you... jogging. I'm saying you're running because someone's chasing you, but not like casual jogging, not walking what the street. What about a car? Can I be in my car? You can, no, you can, that's the point. Here's the thing. We are in the spy world. Mm-hmm. When the spies, we always see in spy movies, they got the gadget cars. You got oils coming out the back. You got little, like, uh, booster seats that shoot out stuff. You got machine guns. If we had people on the streets, there would be collateral damage. These people would die. So what we do is we want more safety for people. We take everybody off the streets. You're only allowed to get on buses and trains and cars and Ubers and lifts and all that stuff. So mm-hmm. you only got can allow to be in the car. You're not allowed to walk on the street because it's dangerous for you. <clears throat> so I can't ride a bike? No. Scooter? Mm. Moped? Mm. Motorcycle? Maybe scooter and moped, but they better be tricked out. That's on you. Why they got to be tricked out? Oh, you everybody mean? got agent cars, okay? They got super so it's kind of like Super Mario on the street now. Exactly. You gotta be. You can't be walking out. You might slip on a banana. <laughs> <laughs> you might hurt yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what about curfew instead of? No, because if everyone's a spy, all spy things are happening at all times. That's cars on the road at all times, True. doing whatever, shooting whatever. You know, you seen the trailer for the new movie? That man's he. He's on a car or whatever he's doing. He's leaning out and he jumps up in the air. He's like in mid air, and then the the cars crash on the sides. Imagine if there's a pedestrian just right right there. The the door could fly off and hit them in the face. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness, that'd be horrible. So yeah, um, would it be horrible or funny? They die. Is that a concern of mine though? Yes, it's a concern of yours. You horrible person. Uh, <laughs> Anyway, that's most of my point. That's it. Okay. Is it? Is yeah, it most of your that's, point? That's most of my point. Just don't, I mean, you can just give the rest. Don't walk on the street. Okay. Don't walk Would you on the like street. to hear the most? The our explanation of no. more other things, <laughs> other trick things inside of cars, like um, grappling hooks that might miss its target and shoot into your body because you're on the street and you get killed. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's if, if, mm-hmm. if, if it's my time to go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> like you're trying to go to the back. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to get some nacho booty out. <laughs> right. uh, anyway, oh. but those are our points. Let's go on real quick. Eve, what were yours? My first point: self-destructing school test. I like that. That's my favorite point. Out of everything else, that's yes. my favorite one. Um, people would go crazy, cl- clinically insane, I should say. And new security, or not new security? What do we call it? Full body Scans. scanners there you would go. be in all buildings. Mm-hmm. My three points were that sex will be banned because, you know, Lame. there will be uh, people have two families and uh, walking on the street. Giving will be the banned. same name to everybody. Good job, great. <laughs> there you go. I didn't, didn't realize that didn't, that's what you were asking me. What if you didn't have that and then you were like, babe, have you ever thought of changing your name? Well, my last name, I mean, I could take, take yours. No, no, I mean your first. Your, your first. first. How about Oculus Swift? <laughs> yeah. Well, I really like Brian. That's mm. my dad's name. So What's your dad's I'm dad? I'm Brian Jr. That's that, though. Come I don't on. think that takes who are you, away. Who are you junior to now? Let's <laughs> so <laughs> Oculus Rift now, just randomly? It's like, oh my goodness. Come on, let's give your name some meaning. <laughs> <laughs> the joy it brings children. Okay. Anyway, that's the show, guys. Oh. Uh, don't know what you listen to us on now, but you can also listen to us on our main hosting site, which is Pi-B. You can also donate there. Throw us a dollar. You get some treats. You also and a get, holla. And a holla. And you get some uh, flick fails. That's awesome. Comes out every Friday. You'll enjoy it. Also, guys, you can listen to us on iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Google Play, YouTube, SoundCloud. And also, we have a Twitter. We have an Instagram. We have a WordPress, which you can also listen to us on there, too. We have a Facebook. Facebook. You can find us at all of those at Real and Real Pod. Eve, tell them where they can find you. You can find me at home. Um, No, on... Listening to... <laughs> Flick fails. Yes. Or, no, doing the flick fails. Eventually. Well, be, well, one, eventually. Day. When, one day. When one you day. One day. Yeah. Um, oh, you can find me, Miss Lovely underscore Curves. Curves. On Instagram and on Twitter. You can find me at It's a Christian on Twitter. Thanks for listening, guys. Hope you have a great day. Bye.